Well, hello, commanders, engineers, and city planners. Uncle Jay here, back in um, my once creative world where I like to build stuff. And um, today we're going to be playing with the one by one helm and how small we can build things. But to be honest, I already built the two things out of the three that I wanted to build. Or, hmm, I should say two of the same thing. Hmm. But, anyways, yes, I, I even put on my best suit for this episode. So, uh,. Yeah, the purpose of this is just to build as small as we can build. It has nothing to do with practicality. Nothing is it useful, not useful, you know, practical. Yeah, I said that. Hmm. Anyways. Yeah, so I actually recorded this two days ago, but the cable that goes to my microphone took a crap. And the audio was just completely crackly and um, or just didn't come out. And I also lost a uh, close to home episode because of the same problem. So, yeah, I lost about five hours in one day. It sucked, but... So here we are, and um, this is the smaller version of the two. This one's not on the workshop, the other one is. So to make this happen, we have the helm, the one by one helm, which um, I'll put up on screen, the workshop link or in the comments, description down below, that's it, in the description down below. Hmm. And uh, the uh, modded thrusters, in fact, I'll just show you guys. Let's pull up the HUD here. Let's get out of the seat. Or the helm, I should say. And G menu, so helm, not help, helm. This is the one by one, or small helm, I should say, one by one, small grid only. And then the uh, flat thrusters here, you can see like the 10x, 25x, and also have, like, all the other thrusters. It's one of the thruster mods I have. Like I said, descriptions, links, and all that fun stuff down below. So let's, uh, let's take a look at what we got. Now, I'm not gonna lie, this thing is power hungry. I wanted to be able to be not go into the red zone, which unfortunately it does a little bit, but enough that it's acceptable, to hold ore, be, be able to hold ore and still fly in multiple angles. The only weak spot is the side thrusters, because we had, we had to cut back somewhere, right? I mean, I could add another second, maybe a 2x side thruster and then move this forward. But I'm trying to, not minimum blocks in PCU, but, you know, the, the smaller the number, it, it helps, right? You could say we could get rid of the connector and save 125 PCU, but the connector kind of acts as like we're sitting on it, kind of. And I don't think the character would look right if there wasn't anything there. You'd just be kind of like floating in the air. So I think I think they look right being there. Also, I decided to go with my pimp engineering color scheme because that's the only place that this would fit in really with any of my collections, except maybe my mining Uncle Jay's mining consortium. Now, hmm, yeah, maybe like a drone. We could turn this into a drone at a remote an antenna. This could be like a, a mining drone, like a really really small mining drone. Hmm, it's a thought. It's a thought. But um, yeah, four reactors, four batteries, one gyro, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten thrusters, five X thrusters, and uh, yeah. So let's grab the controls here. Right now, our inventory is is empty. So it's just the drill, just the connector, and let's see where is the other one. The other one is right here. And this is the first one I built. This one uses the two X thrusters. And as you can see, it's a little bit more bigger. It does have, uh, I think it still has only four batteries, right? One, yeah, it still only has four batteries, but it has the two X thrusters and it's, um, it's not as power hungry. As the other one, but we can still we can still max out our power, and these both have no problem hold, uh, holding stone. I like the way this one looks, kind of better. But on the other side, you know, sometimes minimalistic, it, it's just it looks better. I mean, sure we can put caps on here and whatnot, but then that's more that's more PCU, and then they would cover the access. So. 
Yeah, now this one's not on the workshop yet, but I think I'm going to put it up on the workshop where that one right there is already on the workshop. Damage is turned off. So that is the um, Ultra Micro Miner. This one's X5. The other one, um, I didn't give it the X2 designation. It's just Ultra Micro Miner, which, um, um, as you can see by our K menu, um, so yeah, that's uh, everything in its place and all that fun stuff. This one empty like i said you can max out the power if you kind of like do everything at once up down sideways and and whatnot we come in here and we'll just um we'll left click and we'll get a load of stone you guys can see how it handles full but what's really really good for this is making tunnels like for a base you want to lay out some tunnels in a base but you don't want to move a lot of voxel this would be this would be great for that gonna shove ourselves in here and we are full nectar's full drill is full and as you can see we still have some up thrust now on our side we're gonna lose altitude but I mean it's it's not horrendous right it's not horrendous it's okay we're going to point straight down, staying up, point straight up, we're staying up. And, and that's that's what really matters, you know, being able to operate in multiple multiple angles. And then we can also collect and um, poop right out our butts. And if we come over here and right click, now I know someone on in the Facebook page commented on you know is one ejector enough you know what I don't think it really matters to tell you the truth because I mean if you want to do this for uh, ejection collection you know where you have another vehicle picking up what you're spitting out um, yeah it would be slow going it would definitely be slow going but as you can see one drill you can make a decent sized small tunnel for a hallway and a base. You just add some flat steel blocks to the bottom. I, I think that's a that's that's kind of a nice little hidey hole, you know, to kind of make. So yeah. You can throw a stone at people if you want. So that is the ultra mini miner, the um X5. Let's come over to the other project I was working on which where is that project at? over here over here so let's just um park this right here for right now what is this right, that can get deleted so another thing i i was thinking was uh what is going oh okay control delete let's just get rid of that control delete let's get rid of that Usually I copy and paste a few things for a blueprints to paste around. So I was kind of working on a, um, like a really small compact, like Walker, maybe it doesn't actually walk. This one uses the hover engine mod Just something, um, it's kind of something, you know, completely unpractical this actually isn't what I envisioned let me relock this so what I was thinking is okay how small can we build we, we can build like a unicycle using using a wheel it's like one wheel a battery a gyro and a one by one helm right so let's grab let's see a wheel so what size wheel do we want we want how about one of these new two by twos let's grab a short off base one by one short let's go with the short left right there's a short left which 
look like this. So let's just place it this way for right now. Where is our plaid? Huh, I didn't magnetize because that's already connected. Okay, all right, so um, control V. No, control X. And then control C, let's just, okay, whatever. Don't care, don't care. Let's go back to what we were doing. Let's just bring this here for right now. Pop that down, so this will be down. So we want to go up. And remember, we want this as compact as possible. So let's grab, let's grab this. Actually, yes. Grab this. I think that could be the battery right here. And then we need a, uh, we need a gyro. So we do this. Let's grab our gyro, which really should be at the bottom, shouldn't it? Hmm. It should be at the bottom. Can we put the gyro here above the wheel? Actually, that is a good question, guys. Uh, no, we need a... Not a guy. We are the guy. We need a gyro. Okay, I'm going to have to control copy this. Flip it over. Let's put our gyro here. And then where is our helm? Grab our helm. And let's take our gyro and put it on um, a Let's put on override. Control C. And hopefully this is enough. Maybe. Hmm. We might need. Nope. Let's turn the override off. Come on. Where are we? Where are we? Where are we? All right. Okay. So, so far this isn't working because we need some kind of kickstand. As I hit every wrong button. F6. F. Control C. We need a kickstand to keep us upright when we're not... driving so let's go back to number two um actually would a magnetic plate work here okay that was weird mag plates if we attach a mag plate we can we can side lock with the mag with the mag plate hmm Okay, that's not letting us do that, but uh Why do you keep going to large grid? What is going? Okay, I don't know how I selected that button, but that is what's being the problem here. Control C. All right, all right, I'm liking this guys. I'm liking this so we can take this and put it on switch lock, uh, auto lock. And then um, hmm, I think what we're gonna do is we're going to take our wheel and we're going to turn off steering. And let's increase our strength. Right. And let's take our gyro off of override and let's drop our power down to like 30. What do you think? 30? Sounds good. So let's unlock. Whoa. Okay. 
Um, that didn't work. You know what I really hate is how we lose we lose our. Uh, we might have to use two gyros. I hate to say it, but we might have to use two gyros on this one. Arg. I think what the problem is, we need to be center over this. Maybe that's what the problem is. We're not center. All of our weight's off the one side, and we need to be on the center. So what if we take off our gyro, take this off. I'm going to leave that there for right now. Let's add... Let's add another plate. Will that allow us to... I'm just thinking out loud here. I don't know if this is going to work or not. If I add the gyro there, right? Can we still can we add the helm here? Yes, we can. Let's add another battery. Hold on. Let's grab this. Another battery. And then let's grab this. Add that there. And then we're going to grab number three. Let's see if we can rotate this. Just kind of like mirror this, but not actually add a wheel. You know, it's just going to be um, for decoration. Maybe. Hmm. I think this will help with the balance. Let's go back to our gyro. Uh, let's go with 50%. Let's keep it 100%, but go on override. And then let's add our magnetic plate. Switch lock. Auto lock. And let's turn our our wheel down. Which one? They're both left. So this one is going to be off. This one has the wheel. Let's turn our power down to like 10%. Yeah. Friction. Let's turn our speed limit like way, way, way down because we don't want to have any accidents. So let's unlock. Let's turn auto lock off. And this is why we need two gyros, I believe. And we just fall right over. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm not good at unicycles, okay? I, I'm not I'm not a unicycle kind of guy, but yeah, you know, it's just an idea of how small we can build. So let's come back to my original Iron Man idea and what I wanted to build. Okay, that just phased through there. Not happy about that. So what we want to do is we want to grab... Let's get rid of this, 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 this. I'm um, getting rid of stuff I know that I need because I'm an idiot. Power blocks. Battery. Gyro. Maybe a small reactor. Maybe. Uh, let's see. What are those things called? Rotors? Rotors. So I'm thinking, let's grab red first of all, because you know it's Iron Man. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna, just gonna drop that there for right now. I want our helm here, which isn't gonna work, so let's just come over here. I'm actually going to do this. I want to drop you down this way, and we'll just we'll just flip it. Come on. One, two. That should be enough. Control C. Let's um, flip that for right now, and then put a helm on there. Number nine. So I want to see. We're standing on this. Okay. That's that's perfect. That's more than enough. Uh, hmm. So I don't really need to make it any wider. Bare minimum. All right. So let's grab a... Let's grab a rotor here. 
grab a rotor here. I know it's kind of weird. But that, that is weird. I'm not going to lie to you guys. That is totally weird. We're going to need a... Uh, We need a battery. Actually, I should put these back one block. And that is because of weight. So let's grab control C. Let's stand this back up. Boom, there we go. That's because of those flat iron plates. Hmm. Zinga. Mango. Oh, it's mango something. Okay. Uh, Alt F10. Uh, entity list. Small grids. You know what? I'm not going to find it. No, I don't want a quick reload. All right. You know what? They're in there. There. Now it's gone. Mag plate. An ag. No, I need a mag plate. Not an ag plate. A mag plate. All right. Now we can get this back in here. There we go. So with us standing here, need to think about, need to think about, let's see. Uh, we want to be shoulder height. We want to be head height. Do we want to be sunken into the chassis? I, th I think that's what we want. I think we want to be sunken into the chassis. So being attached here isn't going to work. It's not going to look right. That's where we're standing. Actually, this is where we're standing. So this could actually be the reactor. And then this on this side. You're not going to let me do it on this side, right? Nope. All right, control C. Let's just put this on its side. Add our, another, add our other one. Okay. All right. I'm liking this. And let's see. How else can we... How can we add to the armor without being like making this ridiculous? Right? Let's see. Let's flip this over. Damage is off. So we are not worried about... Anything else? Okay, number two. That can be our battery. Control C, let's flip this over again. Oh, that actually works. Okay, all right, all right, I'm liking this. Now these will be our, our feet. We have our reactor, we have our batteries, uh, we still need a gyro, and then we need some legs. Control C. Well, let's, um, crap. No, let's see if we can just get this to fall over on its side and help us. No. Okay, so Control Delete. Control C. Okay, now we can put our legs on. Doesn't have to be anything fancy. Doesn't need to be hinges because it's not going to walk. Just needs to be uh, industry blocks. Well, then you then you think to yourself, well, then why bother with the with the rotors, right? Or hinges or or anything that might make it look. To be honest with you, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why. Honestly, it just seems like the right thing to do. 
kind of make it look like it's a, a bodysuit kind of I, that that's that's the that is the only explanation I have now I'm probably doing this backwards I should probably put port magnetic plates with these on the outside just to kind of so it looks more like feet but you know what these are just stabilizers so let's just do that let's do that okay control C and then let's flip this back over and see see let's see how this looks guys let's just see how this looks all right I'm not crazy about the batteries I tell you the truth I think we could get rid of the rotors You know, I think I think we're gonna change this up. Yeah, let's copy and let's just lay this down. Let's get rid of this. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Get rid of you. Let's get rid of you. Let's go back to number six and then the magnetic plates. Okay. That's not what I did, but whatever. Okay. How does this look? I'm liking this. I'm liking this. Okay. So now we need to, Hmm. Hmm. What if Control C, what if we do this instead? We'll take this. Let's get rid of this, 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 and that. And let's go with uh flat first we're just gonna use vanilla thrusters. Grab the regular vanilla small 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 5x 5x um <laughs> let's go to number tab number two let's just clear all this just to make it easy on ourselves and side thrust down thrust side thrust down thrust um, we don't need two down thrusts we don't need two down thrusts we only need one down thrust we have still have access to the reactor through here no we do not okay that's a problem we need access to the reactor to the um to the goodies let's get rid of you that's going to be our our front, our front, our. All right, you're not gonna let me do that. Hmm. Okay. All right. Ah, uh, let's see. How about we will do a non-symmetrical build, which I'm not. I don't like doing, but battery over there. I need. <laughs> Number four. If we put that there, we put the gyro here. I do have that mod with the enclosed um, gyros and reactors. I probably should be doing that for this, but I think this is good for right now. So let's grab our flat thruster, our down, and then. How about our legs? We'll do our legs next so we have something to stand on. And this will be our magnetic plates on here. So we have we have our gyro. Then we can take our thruster and we can put we can put it off to the side. It, it doesn't have to be um, doesn't have to be symmetrical, right? 
I mean, I, I don't like doing asymmetrical builds personally, but like I said, it's not about practicality. It's not about looks. It's how small can we build? So we have vanilla thrusters in all of our directions. We have one batter. We have one reactor. We have our gyro. And let's turn that gyro down to 50%. Uh, nah, let's go with 25. So is this the smallest like hover bike we could make using thrusters? I mean, okay. I guess we're gonna have to do groups for the mag plates or we're just gonna have to mag plates. Let's turn the auto lock off. And I seem to have lost all my up thrust. Why? Okay, so one X is really not enough to hold this up. One thruster is really not enough, but I mean, it, it, it's small, right? It's small guys. Hmm. I don't know. I mean, it's totally unpractical. It, it's totally useless, but if you need to go from point A to point B in a hurry, uh, it would work. I mean, it would work, right? Hmm. All right, so let's we need a thumbnail for this episode and then we're going to call it. It's going on half hour ish. Yeah, I think we're done. We're done. Just just some stuff to do with the one by one thruster. Nothing, nothing useful, nothing practical, but hey, it is what it is. But, you know, let me know down in the comments below and stuff like what would you What's the smallest thing that you think you could build with the one by with the one by one? Like, you know, maybe something practical, maybe something not practical. Hey, it, it's all good in the hood, right, guys? So, commanders, engineers, NC planners, this is Uncle Jay. Until next time.